Multiply by multi-digit numbers. This is the first day Jim drove his new car to work. To afford his installment, he decided to work hard. Working as a teller today, Jim's work is to calculate the total salary of all the employees of his department to be paid. It was such a great number that Jim had to do the multiplication very seriously. There are 297 people belonging to the department Jim is working in. Jim found that each person would get $6,851 after subtracting tax this month. So the department's monthly salary payment is the product of 6,851 times 297. How shall we find it? Though this is a multiplication of big numbers, we can still use the method we've learned before. Let's again assign the numbers to column multiplication. Again, we are doing multiplication similar to the steps we take in two-digit multiplication we have learned before. We first do multiplication on each digit place. Then we sum the partial products up. Let's again first place 6851 on top and 297 on the bottom. With 1 and 7 on the same digit place and a multiplication sign and a horizontal line below. Multiplication with each digit in 6851 with 7 is the first calculation we should do. This gives 47,957. Next, we move 9 to the left of 7 on tens place, and the multiplication of 6,851 times 9 gives 61,659. Remember, we should also write down the first digit of the product 9 on the tens place. Again, we do the same step to 6,851 times 2, with the result equal to 13,702. 2 on the hundreds place. After all of this, we sum up the numbers on each digit place to find the final product. By regrouping every digit, we have 2,034,727 as the final product. Thus, we find Jim's department needs to pay $2,034,727 in total this month. Guys, did you find the correct number?